There was also a great vocalist. This is this one that he did for uh, the Atlantic label or back in the day in the key of G before he stopped doing things in G, a tune called Hey Little Girl. I'll do my best. and got mad at him because was, they just come out of chemo and it, it was about a woman who had no hair. But it's, it's about an underage girl, the guys. It's not, you know, so the fest would have been canceled. The fest would have been canceled, canceled, and then some canceled. Anyway, so two, no hair. Which they made them add to the song so they would put it out. Back when you could put that kind of thing out. How's everybody doing tonight? Yeah. Fest is birthday. Yeah. Last year there was some nasty weather, so it's much better. Much better weather. Here we go. Here we go. Um... Come no hair. 
him to death. Wish she would have married him on some other night. Cause look at that. She ain't got no hair. Will you look at that? Show me this girl's hair. something that's a little bit my own, which is probably how Fessel would have wanted it. <laughs> Professor Long here, I don't, I don't know when y'all, did y'all ever get to see him, man? I was, I was 13 yeah. years old. Um, basketball stadium, JCC, this guy Red, uh, Brooklyn Red, got shot over a leather coat uh, on uh, Canal Street, and uh, he was a volunteer at the JCC, and so Fess came and played for us. I was like 12 years old, like, <laughs> never looked back. Anyway, we're about to do a tune called, uh, Cry to Me, which as we all know is an actual, it's a Salad and Burke tune, so it's a Professor Longhair derangement of his own. Uh, I'm going to do a big fanfare and then there's like an eight count. I'm going to womp, I'm going to womp, and then we're going to count eight. All right? Yeah. 
He actually gave Fess his stage name. So uh, without me telling you more facts, let's bring back our youngest performer with the very, very old soul, Mr. River Eckert. 